uh, I think you know something similar needs to happen to, to solar. We really need to make solar panels as appealing uh, as, as electric cars have become. Like the interesting thing is the houses you see around you are all solar houses. I don't know if you know that. I don't know if you, did you notice? We, we need to do everything we possibly can to accelerate the transition to sustainable energy. The, the goal of Tesla, Tesla, people sometimes think of Tesla as an electric car company, but the whole purpose of Tesla was to accelerate the advent of sustainable energy. Tesla's green future and the switch from fossil fuels to renewable energy were long-term promises made by Elon Musk, who explicitly mentioned the solar roof product. Tesla, however, recently declared that it will no longer schedule solar roof installations in most areas. So what exactly transpired with the Tesla solar roof? Let's find out in today's episode of Tesla Car World. By the way, welcome back to the channel, and if you're new, we'd appreciate it very much if you could subscribe as well as ring that bell so you won't miss out on the next exciting episode of Tesla Car World. Now, let's get started with today's content. Musk is continuing to grow his footprint in Texas by installing the latest version of Tesla's solar roof on thousands of new homes. In early June, developers in Austin announced an entire neighborhood will be built with the third version of Tesla's solar roof tiles, as well as adding Powerwall battery technology in every home. However, the Tesla solar roof has run into technical issues and mounting costs in manufacturing and installation, leading to exasperated customers and even a lawsuit from Walmart for fires allegedly caused by the solar panels. During a first quarter earnings call earlier this year, Musk admitted to significant mistakes with the previous roof iterations, but made improvements to the technology. It appears that the issues with Tesla's solar roof, particularly those pertaining to durability and safety signs, are becoming more and more serious. As you'll see in this footage, this particular solar roof was pelted by baseball-sized hail in Texas which caused plenty of damage to the area. Now, is this the key factor for Tesla's decision to halt building solar roofs across the US, namely in Texas? Well, Tesla has paused scheduling new solar roof installations in most markets in the US. It's not clear what's happening, but the deployment of the solar product is at a crawl and way behind Elon Musk's goal. When launching the solar roof, the CEO said that he aimed for Tesla to produce 1,000 new solar roofs per week by the end of 2019. It was always clear that Tesla was far behind on that goal, but we didn't know by how much until earlier in July. The company never released data on its solar roof installations and always included them with its solar panel retrofits, which represent the vast majority of its solar power deployment. Earlier this year, we obtained solar roof installations for the first time and confirmed that Tesla deployed 2.5 megawatts of solar roofs during the second quarter of 2022. That would equate to about 260 medium-sized home installations last quarter at 9.6 kilowatt per installation, or roughly 20 each week, according to off-the-top calculations. A more generous estimate, say if we assume each installation were rated at just 5 kilowatts, would still place Tesla somewhere around 38 per week, or nearly 4% of the way, toward that 1,000 per week target. Tesla did not respond to a request for comment on the report, but the company may have bit off more than it could chew. We basically made some significant mistakes in assessing the difficulty of certain roofs, Musk said last year as Tesla hiked its prices for some buyers. You just can't have a one-size-fits-all situation, he said. Supply chain issues could also be a factor. For the first quarter of 2022, Tesla reported a sharp drop in solar deployments, most of which involved conventional panels. The company blamed import delays beyond our control on certain solar components for the decline. Now, before Tesla decided to stop installing, what was the customer's attitude towards solar roof? The solar roof product has proven very popular. The appeal of Tesla's solar roof has changed that, and customers are now opting to replace their roofs not because they need to, but because they want to. This massive shift in customer mindset was explained by Kelly Roofing, a roofing contractor and Tesla certified installer in Florida. This is a massive shift in customer sentiment as homeowners typically only replace their roof when they need to because of the high cost associated with it. 
When a homeowner replaces their roof, it's typically only done when their existing roof is aging and needs to be replaced, and not because they have an extra twenty to thirty thousand dollars burning a hole in their pocket. Our Tesla partnership was eye-opening. For the first time in our company's history, roof owners are deciding to replace their roof because they want to, not because they need to. This is a paradigm shift in the sales process, and I'm proud to be a part of it. This has helped our revenue and standing with the community boom said Ken Kelly, president of Kelly Roofing. Kelly Roofing is no stranger to Tesla solar roofs. The company installed $12 million worth of the product on Florida homes and commercial buildings since becoming an installer less than one year ago. In 2021, Tesla launched their latest version of the solar roof tile. The roof tile is the same physical size as the previous version, but is more efficient and provides a 22% increase in max power output. Moreover, when the power outage lasts for a long time, the microgrid is an effective solution, and the Tesla solar roof can be perfectly connected to this type of grid, making customers see more potential. To briefly explain, microgrids are self-contained networks of energy providers and consumers. Instead of the classic hub-and-spoke model for electricity grids with massive power plants at the center, individual homes can generate and store their own electricity, while command center software manages supply and demand between them. Although most microgrids are connected to the grid, these networks can also operate independently if there is an outage. And Tesla's solar roof technology is well positioned to facilitate a microgrid. The solar roof software is designed for interconnection and the company already offers microgrid controller software as part of its energy offerings. Eventually, Tesla may be able to offer residents of neighborhoods like Sun House the benefit of a microgrid to protect against future blackouts. Tesla is scheduled to publish their 2022 second quarter earnings report after markets close. The report will provide the latest stats on their energy division and may shed some light on this potential solar roof tile issue. And that's it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching, and if you'd like us to cover a specific topic, please let us know in the comments section down below. And if you enjoyed today's episode as much as I did, make sure to leave a like and consider subscribing and enabling notifications so you never miss an exciting update from Tesla Car World. Once again, thank you so much from all of us here. We hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care and be safe.